Hey, what's going on, guys? We're back with another video today. And today is going to be um, whether or not you guys should buy Infinite Warfare. I mean, overall, I think it was a pretty good game. But, like, some things I didn't like about it was, like, the jetpacks. Like, most people didn't like the jetpacks because everybody was telling them, like, put the boots on the ground. And, pe like, they just didn't listen. It's been like that for about three years now. And, like, everybody's been hating on it. So I'm not sure why they did that. Um... Another thing they did is, like, the kill time is way too low. Um, I mean, it's kind of a good thing and a bad thing, because, like, you can kill people fast, I guess, but, like, you can have noobs just, like, hit you with three bolts and kill you. Like, in Black Ops 3, there was a higher kill time, so, like, you could, like, turn on people and stuff, but, like, if you turn on somebody in, like, Infinite Warfare, like, they, like, they must not have any thumbs or something. Like, it's, like, really hard to turn on people. A good thing about... Infinite Warfare, though, is that, like, it's a new game, obviously, so, like, you have to give it, like, at least a chance. Um, it comes with COD 4 if you buy the Legacy Edition or, like, the Digital Lux Edition. I would I would buy the Legacy Edition if you got Infinite Warfare, because, like, yeah, you get two games, out. it's just, like, a way better deal. And the snipers in it are really fun to use, like, the Widowmaker. A bull action, like like a two round burst like that's like kind of weird to think about but it's like a really good sniper the kbs longbow is really nice and i think overall i would definitely get it if i were you but if you're thinking about like contemplating between battlefield and call of duty i would say whatever like game you like to play like if you like got battlefield 4 and you thought it was gonna be fun and you weren't really good at it and then you like played like call of duty ghost and you got you were like good at that one you like that I would probably get Infinite Warfare, but, like, if you like Battlefield, I would get Battlefield 1. And in the gameplay, if you guys want to know, I was using the K, K bar, I think that's what it's called, and I got the, I got the Thor, it's, like, the third highest score streak in the game, it was really, I, I thought it was, like, an underpowered score streak, to be honest, but it might have just been the map, since I was on Terminal, and there was, like, a lot of, like, a lot of the places inside, so it couldn't really kill that many people. But I got it again another game. I just didn't, like, save that recording so you guys can't see that one, unfortunately. I got it on Frontier. And I switched it to, like, the single shot, um, missile. So, like, it was, like, way more powerful. And I was killed. I killed, like, ten people with it. It was really nice. So if you guys like the video, like, kind of subscribe and see you guys later. Got him, coach. Oh, kill yourself. No, the bait is only out for a couple more days. Still, it's fun. It's heck of overdose fun. I was almost level 50, I was like level 40 something. What's the highest, um... I think somebody got it. Me. Down to <laughs> No, because they gotta do their homework first. I see that. Ooh, fucking dust. Fucking almost do. Tech chopper. You know, that's a jet. Bruh! I'm smart. We're getting locked down. Let's 
see that. Shock, I know. Oh, got a Thor again. Kill yourself, haters. You're the one that has all the rockets. I'm of no use. Mm. He's right above us. So yeah, as you can see, I'm not the most reliable vehicle partner. So accurate. Oh shit. <laughs> Couldn't tell. I'm not an engineer, damn it. Damn! 7-0-4 to 0.